Hi everybody, Beloved911 here again. I just got a comment on one of my videos from Thrashman Tim. He's asking me how to make one NPC say something different based on the outcome of an encounter with a different NPC. So I'm going to tell you now that this is all using um, switches. So I have two N uh, NPCs here, two girls. And the first one, uh, actually, the second one, uh, you have to have a blank page without any conditions on it, or else you're not going to have any character until uh, after you talk to the other NPC, which is something you might want. Um, personally, I don't want that, for this scenario at least. So I want both NPCs just uh, to be there at the very beginning. So um, when you talk to her, she says you should go talk to the other girl. Now, there's nothing after that, so this page is going to stay the way it is. If you talk to her again, she'll say the same thing. But when you go over to the other girl, you talk to her, she says, Hi, how are you doing today? And uh, you have two choices. Um, if you don't know these commands, go and check out my other videos. Um, they're all tutorials on uh, the event commands in RPG Maker XP. So you have two choices. There's fine and not too good. In case you missed that, she's asking you uh, how you're doing today. So here, uh, when you pick fine, um, I have two control switches here. The first one turns on uh, switch number four for me. Uh, you can have w whichever switch do you, you want, but make sure they match up at the very end. So I have uh, a control switch four off and control switch three on. Now I'll explain why both of those are going at the same time in a minute. Um, when you pick not too good, uh, it'll turn control three off and control four on. Um, so, what these are doing, um, I'll have to show you in the other NPC, but when you pick fine, it's turning 4 off and 3 on. So, on, uh, I have two more pages for the second, uh, NPC, and on my third page here, it uh, says switch, uh, under conditions, um, control, uh, uh, switch 3 is turned on. So that when 3 is turned on, she'll be saying, hello, I hear you're having a fine day. And the reason that uh, control switch uh, 4 is being turned off is that uh, page number 2, uh, the conditional switch is that 4 needs to be on. So uh, if you go back to the... Uh, the other, uh, the first NPC, after saying fine, number three will be on. If you go to the other girl and talk to her, then that page will show up. But if you come back and say uh, not too good to her, then it'll turn that one off and turn number four on. And when you do number four, uh, she'll be saying, hello, I heard you're not, or you aren't having such a great day. I hope you have a better day tomorrow. So, that's the way it's done. Um, I don't know if that was clear enough for you guys. If uh, you want me to remake this video, let me know. I'm just really tired right now and don't feel like explaining it better than this. Um, if you have any comments or questions, uh, leave comments on this video. Uh, don't be afraid to email me. Um, I'll leave that in the description. Uh, don't be afraid to leave me messages on MySpace. Subscribe to my videos if you like this. Give me five stars, I'd really appreciate it. Um, thanks to all my fans. Another announcement, I've already made a video of this, but I'm making a MySpace for my uh, RPG Maker XP stuff. I'll be posting resources, as in sprites, pictures, game over screens, uh, tile sets, you know, things like that. Uh, music. Um, I'm going to be learning to script soon, and I've decided I wanted to do that. So um, I'll be posting my journey on learning to script and if you guys want to follow that you'll uh, hopefully be able to learn with me um, and uh, that's pretty much it I'll leave my uh, URL link to my MySpace site uh, in the description and I hope to see you guys soon uh, in my next video so I'll see you guys later thanks again for watching bye